We're going to start the salsa recipe by chopping the vegetables that we're using for the base of the salsa. For this recipe, I'll be using one green pepper, one large onion, two large tomatoes, a handful of carrots, and four garlic cloves. If you like spices, you can also use a jalapeno pepper, and if you like sweet, you can also add in a mango. So let's begin by chopping our vegetables. To slice the carrots, I like to chop them vertically in slices of four. Next, we will finally chop our garlic. For the onions, we will be chopping them into larger chunks. And the green pepper will be chopped into about 1 inch cubes. Next, I'm also chopping my tomatoes into cubes. Once all the veggies are chopped, we can set them aside and start by preparing our tofu. So for this recipe, I'm using one block of extra firm tofu. We'll start by using a paper towel and squeezing as much water as we can out of the tofu block and then chopping them into bite-sized pieces. We will then toss the tofu with about 1 tablespoon of cornstarch, 1 teaspoon of salt, and 1 teaspoon of black pepper. So once we've tossed the tofu, we can next start frying the tofu. The best way that i found to do this is by using a shallow oil and frying it until it's crispy on one side and then turning it over. Next we're going to start building our salsa. So let's start by frying our garlic. Then we can add in our tomatoes and onions. Next I add in the remaining vegetables followed by one can of tomato paste. Next, add in about a cup of water and let the veggies simmer. We will then add one teaspoon of oregano and one teaspoon of chili flakes. Next, we can add in our fried tofu. We will let this simmer for a couple of minutes on medium heat and then we are ready to serve. This salsa tofu tastes amazing served with noodles and arugula leaves or with some rice. The flavors from the salsa are super yummy and you get a healthy variety of veggies and protein all in one dish. Tofu is an excellent source of healthy protein filled with all of the 9 essential amino acids. It's also a great source of iron and calcium and it's so versatile because it comes in so many variations like soft, firm and extra firm that can each be used for its own purposes. I've been using it as a meat replacement in many of my dishes and the flavor of tofu has really grown on me. So give it a shot and leave a comment below to let me know how you find it. Thank you so much for watching this recipe and please remember to check out my channel where I share more recipes, health tips and information about being vegan.